Hello, my name is Nicholas Santillo, and in this assignment walkthrough video, I'll be showing you how to create an indicator group in DHIS2. All right, so let's create an indicator group in DHIS2. We'll pop over into our instance, and we'll go right down to the maintenance app. In the maintenance app, we'll find the indicator area, so that's either here at the top, or I can scroll down to indicators, and I'll click on the indicator group. Well, you don't have any right now, so I'll just create one by clicking the plus there. I can create USDA indicators will be the name of my group. And we can see here we have a couple. So I'll just do this one because I know that this one is a USDA related indicator. Not so sure about that other one. So we'll leave it there for now. Then I click save and I have my indicator group created. Indicator groups are very useful because when I go into my reporting, I can search by indicator group, which will make it faster to pull up the indicators that I want to be looking at. And that's how you create an indicator group in DHIS2. Thanks so much for watching. You can access our curriculum at the link you see there or email us at info at logicaloutcomes.net.